One of IronCAD's unique capabilities are its catalogs. Users can use these catalogs of various standard shapes to simply drag and drop to start building elements. You can also use these catalogs to create your own custom elements, whether they're parts, features, or assemblies. And you can build quite large data sets inside of these catalogs. One of the new features that's been added is the ability to group elements together. You can simply multi-select by shift, holding the shift key or the control key, or simply box select elements that you'd like to add to a group, and simply right-click on the item and say create group. This group can be renamed to anything that you desire, or you can actually click into these to see what elements are contained in this catalog. You can also drag and drop from the scene environment into these catalog groups to add more elements. Once a group is created, you can simply drag and drop it into the environment, and you'll see the full list of catalog elements that contained in that group. Select the desired one by just double-clicking it, and it will be placed into your design environment. This is very handy to create multiple sets of groups. and use them to drag and drop into an environment. All your behavior that's attached to each element is still maintained with inside the groups so that you can get intelligent behavior, for example, this positioning as I automatically drop onto an existing part. So a very convenient way to actually group all your elements, rename them, and actually shorten the amount of elements that you see in your catalog item, making it much easier for users to get access to various things that they need to use, but also providing a nice flexible way to store and add and edit uh, your elements.